This guy didn't have any shoes and he was on the subway. And, um, you know, he's walking around without shoes on. He looked horrible. He didn't look healthy. You know, he was sick. And so he's walking around the subway and I'm like, dude, you got to get some shoes on. You know, maybe you can, you want mine? You know, and his feet were like way too big. He's just like, you know, that's not going to work. And, you know, they were. They're just like, you know, not going to work. And then, um, so I gave him the four bucks that I had in my wallet. That's all I had. And I was like, dude, you got to get some shoes. Go to a church or go to a, you know, shelter. You know, it's like, you know, here I am passing it on, you know. I couldn't stop at that moment. Everything should have stopped and I should have helped that man get some shoes. You know, what, what, what's, what's the fucking problem? So he's, he's walking out the door with the $4 that I gave him. As soon as the door closes, I'm like, ah, shit, you know. I wanted to go home and see my dogs. This is the truth. I wanted to see my dogs. When I'm away from my dogs, I'm a freak. You know, I worry about them. So I wanted to get home and see my dogs. But if I would have just stopped and taken a half an hour out and gotten this guy some fucking shoes, it would have meant, you know, big deal. It's a half an hour. The dogs don't give a shit. It's my own neurotic mind, you know, worrying about my dogs. You know, that's, that's me. So... If that ever happens again, if I ever see that again, I'm going to stop. Everything should have stopped at that moment, and I should have helped that man. I should have at least helped him get some shoes or, or maybe, you know, talk him into going to a hospital. He obviously, you know, he had issues. He's walking around without shoes. Do you know what I mean? He's not just homeless. He's homeless without shoes. I feel horrible. You know, there's, there's like this thing that like human beings and that was me. I, you know, I mean, I gave him four bucks, but I clearly could have stopped and given a half an hour of my time and, you know, $45 and gotten him some shoes. But it's like this thing about human beings. It's like sometimes we're shitty to human beings. I know people that'll feed a cat, you know, or help a homeless dog, but they won't help a human being. I, I don't know what that is. I don't get it. You know, but clearly like, you know, I'm sort of like that too. You know, I just push it on and say, go, go find a shel shelter that has shoes. What's the matter with me? Do you see what I'm saying? I felt bad ever since. I'm like, you know, I've been, I, I don't have the money to be buying a homeless guy's shoes, right? I don't. I'm broke. I got a place upstate. I got a place in Brooklyn. But I have a place. I have two places. Do you see what I'm saying? What my point is? Why I feel shitty? about myself, because I have all this. You know, I have worries, sure. But my worries aren't like his. He doesn't have any shoes, you know? Never again, never again. If I ever see that again, everything stops, and I'll get the man some shoes. That, that sucks. It sucks, really. You should... Everybody should be helping everybody. You should help human beings. You should, you should help these other species. They're, you know, we're related to them. We are. We're all related by common ancestry. Everybody should help everybody. You know, don't just walk away. And if you do, catch yourself doing it and don't do it again. You know, really. Pay less shoes. How much could it have cost me? A half an hour of my time. You know, my busy, busy time.